I mean, I think I've told this story before, right? We had a client maybe like six months ago and like the cheapest we could get his ad down to was like a dollar and 80 cent cost per click, which y'all in US, which y'all know that's not cheap. You know, so it's not cheap at all. But his tone in click through rate was like a 95% conversion rate. Like that shit was stupid. It was like, he literally, like literally almost every person that clicked through on the ad went to a DSP. He had one fan playlist where that fan had listened to the song like 80 times in a week. You know what I'm saying? That one week. And so like that to me, at least what we tried to tell him was like, bro, like the ad is expensive because I mean, people probably don't really fuck with the content like that. But the people that are clicking through on this shit really fuck with the music. This to me is worth it for you to now figure out how can you make more engaging content around this song to get your initial ad cost cheaper? Because like you can get you can get that ad cost even 30 cents cheaper, right? We're not even talking to nothing crazy like 20, 30. If you get if you could have made something that would get that ad cost down to let's say 80 cents and maintain that 85 that 95 percent conversion rate, that would be stupid. You know what I'm saying? If you could get down from 85 to 50 percent or whatever and maintain that same click through rate. That would be even crazier, right? And like that part is just a matter of like making a, a bunch of new content around it and trying stuff out. Um, because like typically, I don't know, ads to me are the easiest way to like test and figure out what that is, is what's worth it as far as like doing that stuff. But it's like, you know, that's not the end all be all of the marketing campaign. It's like that that to me is like step one. Like, all right, great. We have an ad that's doing well, it's running well. Let's make sure you got enough money to feed it. Now let's get into this cultural shit. Who are the influencers we're going to tap into? What pages are we getting you posted on? What type of content are you making? What narrative are we building around you? Like, that is the shit that, like, you know, in my opinion, isn't really worth doing unless you know that the song is working. But the moment I see some shit was like, bro, this ad is cheap. These view rates are crazy. You're getting all these followers, these engagement. The streams are going up. You know what I'm saying? Followers are going up. That to me is like, yo, bro, you don't even got to drop shit else. I mean, you can, right? But like, now let's, let's start to figure out how can we do more with this? You know, because like I always tell y'all, you were to do everything in the marketing space, you'd be pushing the same song for at least six to nine months. You know what I'm saying? Like at least, you know, um, realistically longer than that if you're talking about the shit's like really, really, really working. So, um, but so I try to get clients to that as fast as possible because I see what happens when they're trying to bounce from single to single. They burn money and then it's like, okay, we spent $20,000 on four singles. You know, one of these was clearly doing amazing. One was doing okay, yeah. and the other two were ass. But we spent five bands on each of them as if they all deserve the same amount of attention. They really fucking did it. You know what I'm saying? Wow, what's up? It's Brand Man Sean. And if you got value from this video, we got a ton of value to offer you in brandmannetwork.com. It's completely free. The link is in the description if you want to talk with us directly or some of the people in our community in between videos so you can ask questions specific to you or hop on one of the live sessions that you see on the channel when we're speaking with other artists. Brandmannetwork.com is the place to go. Hop into our app. It's really dope. And you get access to free courses as well. But it might not be free forever. So hurry up and get in there before I change my mind.